Hey guys, what's up? It's Snake Dude 1814 here, and this is gonna be a vlog. I'm actually driving down to Indiana to do a collab with Indiana Herbs and Invertebrates. So, with the magic of camera editing, we'll go from my car, and here we are. So, for those of you that don't know, I've been talking with Indiana Herbs and Invertebrates, the uh, another YouTube channel that he actually sent me hissing roaches a while back. And so I figured I'd drive out and we were going to do a little bit of a collab. I figured I'd just vlog my day here. We plan on making some s'mores and just doing a bunch of fun stuff. Probably going to go out looking for spiders at night. But, you know, uh, let's go straight to the fire pit. Look at this giant pile of firewood. It's amazing. Leyland, say hello. Hi. What are you about to do? Don't try this at home. Oh, shoot. Dude, that one like 15 feet high. Fire just went like. Now my hand's covered in lamp oil. Lit. So something that's kind of cool, guys, is that Leyland, his backyard pretty much goes out into the forest. With this much forest for a backyard, we might as well go into it. This is so awesome, man. I don't know how any of you viewers feel, but comment down below if you agree. Whenever you're walking to the forest, you ever just feel like you're being watched? I mean, Leyland's right behind me. I don't know, man. I feel like there's eyes everywhere. Oh, lightning bug. Lightning bug. Wow, guys. Look at the size of this mushroom. This thing's huge. That's my hand compared to it. It's a big mushroom. You know, even though we are like a, a reptile channel, even seeing things like that mushroom you just saw, and just being out with nature feels great. Wouldn't you agree, Leyland? Yes. He agrees. Part of this little vlog has to involve herps and invertebrates, and so let's go spider hunting. So take a look at that, guys. That is a nice big wolf spider. That's part of the benefit of coming out this late. There it is next to Leyland's thumb for reference. What an It's awesome a good inch and a half oh. leg span on it. What an awesome find. Nice little fishing spider here found by Leyland. Only about an inch in leg span. They can get a leg span as big as my palm. Nice. Awesome find. Nicole, they're semi-aquatic, correct? And as you um, can see, the camera picking up the eye shine that they get when they're under the light. It depends. And there's a wasp in there. Hmm. Either way, an awesome find. Look at some of these guys. Harvestmen. Or, or daddy long legs, as I call them. I won't lie guys, this is pretty epic. My camera sucks filming at night, but that's because I'm outside. But so far all I can say is that it's a lot of fun looking for spiders out here. Even some of the common species like that giant wolf spider we saw. You know, you don't see those out during the day. Thanks for the light, Leyland. But uh, let's keep looking. <laughs> all the frog vocalizations at night. And if you guys look right in the middle of that branch, it's not focusing because of how distant it is. And my camera is in full zoom. Those are actually two gray tree frogs mating. Amazing what you can find it here at night. Another very large grass spider. About an inch and a quarter leg span. So here we found a female wolf spider carrying an egg sac. Pretty awesome. And they also attach it to their bottoms as you can see. So this here is an American giant millipede. Just chilling out on this black cherry tree. Not too giant, though. It <laughs> looks awesome, though. I'm not sure, but it would appear to be, yeah, he's stuck in the sap. Yeah, he's stuck. Oh, come on. Oh, there you go. Here, crawl onto here. There you go. Yeah, this is always a good place to look for interesting stuff, because the sap snares things. Gosh, that is such an awesome find. Yeah, you don't see these guys too often. Well, I'm glad we got him on video. And these guys also produce some pretty nasty skin irritants, too. Hmm. Then I'll just keep my hands on the camera. So as we were just letting this guy go, I looked over on the branch, and there's actually another smaller American giant millipede, although clearly not living up to the name. But that's two millipedes on one tree. What are the likes of that? We just found this other fishing spider. Um, Alex? Yeah. What? Oh, frick. So what is that, Leyland? It's even better than we thought. What is it? It's got an egg sac. She's got an egg sac? Yes. Let's be, oh, wow. Look at that. What species is that? 
Definitely a fishing spider. Oh my, ooh. Oh. Scared me half to death. Huh. You yes. can see how big her egg sac is. That is epic. It's like dime in diameter. What a find. I was just admiring this little guy and stumble upon her. That's epic, man. Yep. Awesome. So what do we find here, Leland? It is a small orb weaver or silver crossback spider. Don't have the exact species for sure. But nonetheless, another awesome spider. So up here on this little gutter, gutter of a house, We've got what appears to be a wood roach. Yes, a female wood roach it would appear. Let's see how fast it is. Oh, no. Okay, it's not in the mood to run. Never mind. <laughs> Either way, I mean, I'm happy she's staying on camera for us. Huh. You guys know me. I love my roaches. So. Here we have a fully grown fishing spider. I can't tell its gender because its ped pelts are not in view. But it is currently eating a harvestman, otherwise known as a daddy long leg. And here's my hand for some comparison. Now with its legs stretched out all the way, it would be about the same diameter as my palm. Which is about three and a half inches. It's a big spider, and it's awesome. Very awesome. In vlogs, people do stupid stuff. And as you guys know, back in my prime time of live streaming, I had a passion for one thing. Talking with you guys and drinking a good old-fashioned Arnold Palmer. Well, Leyland here also happens to love iced tea as well. So today, we're gonna do a tea challenge to see who is the most tea-addictive YouTuber. We each have equal fillings of our preferred iced tea. Here we go. Three, two, Darn. <laughs> <laughs> oh, almost. That was very close. But. And I hadn't had to stop because my mouth was hurting from the cold. Yeah, I had to stop as well. Well fought, Leyland. <sighs> well fought. <laughs> well. I don't know if I won something today, but I'm a tea addict. So overall, guys, that's the end of our little fun vlog. Until then, this has been the Snake Dude 1814. And Indiana Herbs and Invertebrates. And stay tuned for more videos regarding invertebrates and reptiles in the future. Adios. Bye. Don't try this at home. Oh, boy. I feel like that Let's was anti- fail. Yeah, that was anticlimactic, bro. That's it. I give up. I forfeit. Top 10 saddest anime deaths. Peace!